Well, that's a nice staff. Now all we have to do is get out of here with it. The blowing snow stings your eyes, making it hard to see. Even so, you can make out the gigantic form of Scaldy Frostwalker coming towards you through the snow. His heavy steps somehow muffled by the thick blanket of snow on the ground. You cannot leave with the Ancestor's staff. As the party leaves the Chamber of the Ancestors, Scaldy Frostwalker will confront them about leaving with the staff. The area is blanketed with blowing snow, making it difficult to see, and everything will be lightly obscured. Any attacks at range of more than 15 feet will be at disadvantage. If the party decides to give the staff back to the frost giant, he will let them leave and go on their way, and that's the end of the encounter. <laughs> However, if the party wants to keep the staff, then Scaldi will attack the party. If he is close enough to the party, he will attack whichever party member is nearest him with his multi-attack. With plus 9 to hit and an average damage per attack of 25, if the party is not at full health, this could be a very dangerous battle for them. Once the battle is finished, the party can leave this area with their spoils and head to the next area within the level 3 of the Mega Dungeon, which is the Lair of a White Dragon. You can check out this playlist here to see other videos within the Mega Dungeon, and come back tomorrow to see the entrance to the White Dragon's Lair.